give up on God. Because he won't give up on you. towards to get to that's what we are in if we are believers we are in the kingdom of God and he said there was a certain man a master of ceremony a king and he was having a feast and he said go and invite all my friends send the invitation out somebody said invite me Lord Right, and he sent out the invitations far and wide telling his friends to come come and feast with me come and eat with me come and celebrate with me Some of you got married and you sent out wedding invitations and know some of the person you sent invitations to, they did not show up. Just imagine you're celebrating something great and no one shows up. They don't show up to your feast. And Jesus said, the head, the king, the, the master of the ceremony of the feast, when his servants came back and they said, listen, master, we invited them, but this one say, I'm too busy. Mm -hmm. This one said, I'm doing this and I'm, I'm doing that. I can't make time. I'm making money. Mm -hmm. I'm too busy for you. And that Lord, that master, that king, he decides, you know what, if my own people would not feast, if my own people would not enjoy the feast that I have prepared, I'm going to go on the highways and byways. You see, there is too much hypocrisy in the church. Too much hypocrisy in Christianity. It makes people run. That's why a lot of persons leave in Christianity because what we say we believe, we do not. The Bible said, don't be hearers of the word, but we must live the word. The gospel about love and forgiveness. Love and what? Forgiveness. Forgiveness. Lord said, listen, my own people, my own friends, did not want to partake in the feast that I have prepared. Just imagine the Lord of the feast, big pork, kill a whole lamb, a big calf, goat meat, chicken stew. It's like yesterday, we prepared a lot of food. Afterwards, people just eat food. People just get food all over because it, there was enough left back for everybody to get. We feasted. And he said, 
Servants, I want you to go in the highways and the byways. Go in the ghetto. Go in the areas where people neglect. Get in those areas and tell them I invite them to my feast. So the Lord of the feast said, go into the highways and the byways. Go find the ghetto you them. Go and get the prostitutes on the street. Go and get the gunmen. Find the thieves. Go find the liars. Go get me some lawyers. Go get me some rum drinkers. Go get me some marijuana smokers. Go get me some persons who are hooked on heroin, cocaine. Go get me some persons who are, who are shocked up in adultery and fornication. Go get me some sinners and bring them in. And I will clean them up. I will fix them up and they will eat with me. And they will feast with me. You see this feast that is prepared. The Bible says that the first will be last and the last shall be first. And not everyone who says, Lord, Lord, shall enter into the face. Amen. Amen. Amen.